Catchy has won a potential $284 million, single award prime contract from the National Security Agency. Avril Haines, Director of National Intelligence and a two-time WASH 100 awardee, called the Russia-Ukraine war a grinding conflict that will require Western allies to continue to provide Kyiv with security assistance for it to win on the battlefield. The Social Security Administration intends to launch a new IT strategic plan that prioritizes customer-centric and data-driven initiatives, according to SSA Deputy Chief Information Officer Patrick Newbold and Chief Data Officer Rob King. An annual report of the Department of Defense's Office of the Director of Operational Test and Evaluation has recommended that DOD perform cyber survivability testing of all digital modernization strategy enterprise IT programs and projects in accordance with the department's cyber guidance and policy. Rich McManus, former senior technical advisor to the U.S. Strategic Command, has joined the U.S. Space Force as deputy director of its Force Design Integration Office, he announced in a LinkedIn post. The National Institute of Standards and Technology has published a concept paper ahead of the launch of the second version of its cybersecurity framework. Major General Heather Pringle, commander of the Air Force Research Laboratory, has underscored the importance of upgrading the infrastructure at AFRL sites across the U.S. to enhance science and technology capabilities for warfighters. Jeff Smith, former deputy for operations at Oak Ridge National Laboratory, has been appointed interim director of ORNL as the laboratory searches for a permanent successor to Thomas Zachariah. Homeland Security Forum on February 7, 2023. Visit executivebiz.com slash events. The Securities and Exchange Commission is inviting members of the public to submit applications for appointment to an advisory committee that provides recommendations on regulations and policy matters related to small businesses. The Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency is soliciting research proposals for a program that seeks to develop modeling tools, surface and field controls and structures aimed to support future space and ground telescope systems.